Hey everyone, this is Matt King with the King Pierce team. We're out here on day three in Oakland Park, Kansas. As you can see here, we have our piers that are gonna be going down here in the basement. We have our holes already saw cut. Here very shortly, we're gonna be jacking and out the uh, section of concrete here so we can start our digging. Uh, should be a fairly short dig. Uh, should be finished up by the end of the, of the day today. Uh, this uh, floor is already setting on the uh, the footing, so it should be fairly easy to get through to make this below that. Um, again, once we are done with all the piers, we're going to be coming back, finishing up the epoxy injection on the foundation wall cracks. Uh, if you look closely, you can actually see the signs that there was uh, water infiltration in the past coming through these cracks, uh, especially here in the corners. So we're gonna make sure that those are all sealed up correctly. And then we're gonna go look outside where the rest of our piers are going. Bear with me for just a second here. Yeah, you can already hear our guys starting the jackhammering. So we'll walk back to the backyard. We have one footing exposed here on the corner of the house. So that should be done by the end of today as well. Just getting the, getting properly excavated underneath that footing. Over here, this one still needs a little bit of work, but we'll have that footing exposed by the end of, end of the day. And back over here on the other side of the house, where we have the rest of our piers. We have one in the corner right here. And then the final two are on the side of the house right here. And these last three, they're fully excavated. So you can see the footing right there, got everything. Uh, dug out underneath 13 inches below so Once all the piers are done, we're simply going to place our load-bearing steel plate on The dirt sever below that footing our king pier on top of the plate Two hydraulic bottle jacks and we're slowly just going to elevate That king pier until first it's tied up against the underside of that footing And then we're just going to keep raising it slightly and slowly carefully raising that that concrete footing back up to its correct level elevation and then once the uh, the pier is raised as far as we're going to raise it we will hammer in half inch and quarter inch steel shims between the underside of the pier and the load bearing plate locking the king pier into place and then we're simply just gonna unlock the bottle jacks, pull them out of the hole, and then we're gonna come in with a pour of high strength concrete to encase the king here under the footing. And once that concrete has dried, we're just gonna do the backfill. And uh, you can see the low spots around here. Again, we're going to uh, all this dirt right here. There's there's a mountain of dirt just for, from each of the holes, and we're gonna we're gonna have that looking nice around the around the foundation of the home, any kind of low spots. So there's some low spots underneath the, uh, the front stoop outside. Uh, we're gonna get all that sloped away from the house just to help with water flowing away and just get everything nice and neat. So stay tuned for more updates on this project. You can go to our website, www.kingpeers.com. You can find all of our pictures, videos from current and past jobs on our YouTube and Facebook channels, or you can just give us a call, 816-288-4373.